Only on two, a Rogers Park man woke up to the sound of sawing, went to his window, and captured this. A crew of thieves armed with an assault rifle stealing his neighbor's catalytic converter. Today, CBS 2 investigator Megan Hickey spoke with the frustrated victim. And Megan, to complicate all of this, it happened just two days after she gave birth. Right, Erica and Marie, they, her parents were, it was their parents' car that got hit. They were on their way to pick her up from the hospital with her brand new baby boy. She says the video her neighbor took was absolutely terrifying, and unfortunately, it was not the first time that they were hit. <coughs> baby Walter is just six days old. He's not too worried about what happened early Monday morning, but his family sure is. It sounds like a saw cutting metal. Renee Vickman was in the labor and delivery unit waiting to get a ride home. My dad <laughs> texted me that uh, their catalytic converter was stolen and he couldn't come get me. <laughs> we spoke to Vickman's neighbor who sent us this video. He shot around 554 AM. He heard the sawing and watched this trio of men walking away from her parents Hyundai Tucson. And they're uh, kind of putting something in the trunk and then getting in to drive away and one of them clearly has an assault style rifle. <laughs> Her poor parents were there from out of state just to meet baby Walter. We spoke to Vickman's dad on the phone. They got it, they stole it. So what? The catalytic converter. You got it. <laughs> so they were just on the inside of the street. The worst part, it was the second time this happened to them. Their catalytic converter was stolen on the same corner in May, the last time her parents visited. The bill for both of these thefts is nearly $10,000. My dad had spray painted it orange before he came down because he wanted to hopefully deter them from doing this, and it did not work. Today, CPD said they have no updates in this particular case. We checked in with the Cook County Sheriff's Department, which has been leading the charge with catalytic converter tagging and vehicle repair events. A spokesperson tells me they've been inundated with requests to hold more of these workshops because this is clearly still a problem, one that seems to be getting more dangerous. Clearly still an issue. Really hope that neighbors can just be neighbors and try to help each other out, like watching for this stuff so that it can stop. And the Cook County Sheriff's Department tells me they have at least five catalytic converter events scheduled through the end of this year. The next one is on September 7th in the 5th District for a full list. Head to our website and click this story. Live in Rogers Park, Megan Hickey, CBS2 Investigators.